What is the most famous triptych? One of the most famous of all triptychs is the altarpiece in the Antwerp Cathedral by Peter Paul Rubens, completed in 1612, fig. 1. Rubens' triptych, entitled Descent from the Cross, depicts the visitation, left panel, the descent, middle panel, and the presentation of Jesus at the temple, right panel. What are four paintings together called? According to the Merriam-Webster dictionary definition, a polyptych is an arrangement of four or more panels, as of a painting, usually hinged and folding together. Originally, a polyptych was a religious carving or painting on an altar and had four or more hinged panels telling a story. What is a triptych but four? For example, a polyptych with two panels is called a diptych, a polyptych with three panels is called a triptych, and a polyptych with four panels, like the one we are pretending you saw in your friend's apartment, is called a quadriptych or tetriptych. What are five paintings together called? Apolyptych, plapitych, polyptych, Greek, poly, many, and teich, fold, is a painting, usually panel painting, which is divided into sections or panels. Specifically, a diptych is a two-part work of art, a triptych is a three-part work, a tetriptych or quadriptych has four parts, and so on.